Our next topic is index selection. What is index selection? Index selection means in which query we need which kind of an index. So we already discussed we have B3 index, we have a hash index, we have a brain index, a gen index, and JSON index. It's somehow it's important that we that we should know that on which data type, on which queries we we can create which kind of index on that. So for B3, this index is default index, and most of the time we use B3 index for our data types. So it can be used for greater than, equal to, less than operator, and most of the data types sports B3 index. Hash index, so it's, it's a specific to the equality operator, so it can only be used for the equality operator, so it, it performs better for the, it's not only perform better, but it's the only option for the hash index to be used with the equality operator. And the brings, brin index, for really large sequentially lined up data set. So we discussed that brin is used when it is, it is correlation with the physical storage of the table. So it, so it is very really good to use that when you have a very large sequential data set. So gen, this is used for the documents and arrays. So when you have a document, a JSON document, and you have an arrays, and you want to use some kind of an index, then gen is the better option for you. And the gist, and gist is, uh, we already discussed that, it's a kind of a framework, so it is useful uh, for the full text search. So if you want to do a full set test search, then you can use a gist index for that. Send your comments and query below this video. Take the full course and pass the quiz in our Google class to get a certificate. Just open, open the Google classroom and click join class, enter the code of the class. Thank you.